Hey, Orange One here. So I want to do another like channel video slash analytics deep dive. So I want to talk first of all about my channel and what it like means to me and my kind of mission statement, I guess. <laughs> and then I want to go into some of the stats and kind of like how you'll what my plan is with some of it. So basically, when I got into the whole YouTube thing. I was playing um, a little bit of Kenshi and Cataclysm Dark Days Ahead. This this game, Cataclysm Dark Days Ahead. So it that was like my first game that I loved, but I had this tutorial series that blew up like with Kenshi. And so if you look at my analytics, you can kind of see what I'm known for. It's kind of interesting. So you can look at all of my stats over my entire lifetime as a YouTuber, which goes all the way back to here. Kind of crazy, even just seeing that date. So anyways, like I was playing Cataclysm for a super long time, Cataclysm Dark Days Ahead, and um, not getting a whole lot of views. And then Kenji kind of exploded. And as you can see, my most viewed videos, um, let's see, how do we do this? the top videos, yeah, let's do top videos just so, so you can see them ranked by like their views. Um, no, it's right here. So you can see the like my most viewed video got 60,000 views, 47, 43, so on and so forth. I'll, I'll let you look through that. So you can see that like it's mostly these ones, but um, if you look at just that, that's actually not my first one. Someone actually recommended that I make that. So thank you, whoever that was. If if uh, if you're watching this, that's <laughs> huge for me. <laughs> just like one person made one recommendation, and from that I got like six, my most popular video, right? Um, but like I've got like all these that kind of recommended each other. And if you were to click on any of these, it's kind of interesting. Like I, uh, you can see that like kind of like how people watch it and everything, but the kind of cool thing that I really like is looking at where they're coming from. And you can kind of see that they're actually getting suggested a lot by my other videos. So my videos are pointing people to my other videos. So they've got like pretty good uh, like bait essentially to get people to start watching those and then they watch a couple of those and, and then they go to other things um, you can see also so let's just uh, go back to the original so there's Kenshi and then Bannerlord exploded and like for like a couple days I was like kind of famous um, so yeah I had like some Bannerlord videos I got into like the beta um, and so I was able to get access to the um the multiplayer which then i was able to like poke around with with like this video and a couple other videos and like i think just some factions are more popular than others but you can see it's like literally like just exploded when before the game was coming out people just wanted to see all the armor and the factions and yeah <laughs> that, did, that did really well for me um and then there's a couple actual tutorials that I did that did okay for Bannerlord. But it's kind of interesting at this point. I have some series that actually have uh, like a ton of watch time. So if you look at these, this video here, it's got like quite a lot of watch time. People have watched a lot of this video. Like a third of the people who watch this, that's like a couple thousand watch the whole thing right kind of crazy to think about that so you can see how like that tutorial series led to some people watching that series which also came out around the same time and yeah <laughs> and then i've got also there's just like random other things like i did this for like cyberpunk when it came out so this is done okay so like you can see that like what I'm known for is a lot of it is this Kenshi tutorial series. So that's probably where you're coming from and finding this channel. But if you were to look at like what I've published recently and what I'm continuing to plan on publishing, there's not really any Kenshi here. I haven't really been playing it recently. So I like to play in general like roguelike games, kind of like 
uh, open-ended survival. You got one life, um, like deep immersion kind of simulation games like Cataclysm or Caves of Cud or other other games like that. So if I were to go to my analytics, uh, where's the playlists? I know there's a way to see playlists in here. What is it? I think it's in the advanced mode, maybe. Playlist, yes, you can see the most popular playlists and you can see them over time. And so you can see it's kind of all over the place, right? So my tutorials did really good at first. They've been doing good consistently, right? If we were to look at just that. Um, this kind of started up around that time and I already had some stuff that was up on the internet already so people watch that. This is also a series I started a little bit later. Um, the audio isn't great at the beginning of it but it gets better I think. And then this one the audio and editing is just terrible. This is like my first series I ever did I think. Yeah that's my first series I ever did. I did I've changed like software and like the setup that I use and all kinds of stuff now so it's completely different. Um, Caves of Cud, I really like, I really don't like how they got kind of like cyber attacked recently, but, uh, so I kind of like have been not playing so much of that just because I just myself have been kind of upset about it, <laughs> but it's a good game. It's a really good game, a really good dev and really good mods and yeah. Uh, then we've got our Bannerlord beta that did pretty well. Like, people watched some of that. Oh, yeah, I did play a little bit of Star Sector at some point. I haven't played that in a while. I might bring some of these back. If there's a number of these that you're really interested in, let me know. Put some comments on, on this. Let me know what you'd like to see again. But you know what's really weird is that there's some random videos of just done crazy well. Oh, yeah, Splattercat did, like, an episode on this. And then, like, just the views of people looking at that just exploded overnight. It was just insane. Um, oh, I clicked out of that by accident. I wanted to keep on showing some of these. Oh yeah, we started a new band lord that we were doing now. So you can also look at what's going on recently. So recently, this land is my land has been, um, I don't know why, but it recently got a fair amount of attention. Like, I think that I was getting put on people's, like, page to get to watch for this or something. I don't know. I've got some very dedicated viewers that really watch some of those things, like they binge them a lot. So yeah. Oh, I wanted to show you the weird outliers, the videos that like have uh way more views than you would expect. Uh from from something like that. So in the last 28 days, I was looking at this, there was like something from um Metro. Yeah, Metro Exodus. Look at this video. This this game, I played this whole series and like nobody watched it like at all. <laughs> but look at um how it's done since it's been uploaded. It's been getting a lot of views. And I think that it's got over a thousand views. Like just some random half an hour of me playing that game. Whereas most of them have like maybe a dozen, if I'm lucky. <laughs> um yeah, I also wanted to, I'll just kind of go through each of these sections, I suppose, so you can kind of see the um, the general stats. You can kind of see how YouTube gave me a chance and then it quickly was like, no, you're not getting viral, so <laughs> bottom of the bucket. <laughs> Um, you can also see how a lot of my stuff comes from people searching on YouTube or just browsing. Um, a couple other things. So it's kind of interesting. You've got this thing. It just tells you roughly these major categories, and then the major categories get broken down below. So external, here's the 12.2 there, and then it breaks that down. It cho shows you, like, oh, that your external stuff is almost all Google, you know? And then it's like, oh, hey, look at this. These playlists have done really well. And this is what portion of your views they've been getting you. And so for my lifetime, the tutorial series is like a quarter of my views. It's like totally insane. Um, 
but this is also a significant portion too. That's not insignificant. I didn't realize that at, you know, some of these do so well. And that it has got like 190 episodes in it or something like that. It's kind of insane. Um, so that's, yeah, that page. Engagement, you know, honestly, I'm not like a huge expert on this one. I think this is like clicking, like people clicking on things or something. Or no, this is watch time. This is the clicks. Yeah. So 800 people have clicked on things from that video. <laughs> um, oh, this is kind of cool. Look, so I can see that most people are watching around 9. I've been posting at 6 because I saw that people started watching at 6. I might move my start time to more like 9 because that apparently is what, or 10, is what is recommended. So we'll see about that. Yeah. Um, so I'm going to keep on going through this. I'm just going to take some time, honestly. So there's watch time from subscribers. So that's kind of interesting. Most people aren't subscribed. Almost everyone's from the United States, and you can actually, I believe, if you click on this, you can look at the geography by the state as well. I know, I, sh I should look at the international before I go straight to the state. <laughs> but it's kind of crazy. You can see that, like, California's the biggest, and then, like, everyone else is, like, not really that much. I and mean, there's a couple of people here and there in other places. Um, but I wanted to look at international. You can kind of see it's like a lot of European countries, but there's other other places too in there. And then it just keeps on going down to smaller, smaller percents where it's like, wow, okay, a tenth of a percent, impressive. I guess that I have enough stats for that, so that's good, right? Um, a few other things that you might find interesting your age and gender actually this has gone up a ton recently it used to be that i had like much lower numbers yeah so now like three percent is incredible i used to have like less than half of a percent was female <laughs> it's like how is this this skewed i don't understand <laughs> i i say better it's more diverse right so I don't know. That's better to me. Um, okay. Yeah, you can see that my subscribers actually, um, the views from them have been relatively consistent. It's the unsubscribed that, spike, that spikes up and down. And then we already looked at that. This, I honestly don't, ever really look at. I guess it's kind of interesting. You can see almost everyone is on computer, but there's some variation. And then this is just kind of like how I've got set up kind of stuff. Um, if you would like to see any more things in detail, let me know. This is kind of interesting. If you're, if you're interested, they do have um, like some more info on how that stuff is is calculated. And I'm not going to like read through that and whatnot, but you can kind of see that like how much money I'm making in reality. And I think this is like how much they tell you it is, but like this is what it, when it actually comes down to the actual calculation of total videos and views and all that, it's that. <laughs> um. And you can see, hey, this this one's given me 40 bucks. That's pretty nice, right? I'm happy with that. Happier than without it at least. Alright, I'm gonna I'm gonna sign off. Thank you for joining me. This has been Orange One.